here in the studio. It is National Aviation History Month to celebrate the achievements in the development of aviation. And Oklahoma, of course, has a lot to offer in the aerospace and defense industry, playing a key role in our economy. And joining me this morning to look at some of the fun stuff happening at the Tulsa Air and Space Museum is Alex London, the museum's collections uh, director, right? Correct. Awesome. And thank you, Alex, for being with us this morning. Thank so you for having me. So there is a new exhibition right now. Tell us a little bit about that. Absolutely. So we have a brand new exhibition celebrating the history of the Tulsa American, which was the first, or excuse me, the last B-24 bomber built here in Tulsa. And it was actually funded entirely by factory workers in the Douglas plant where they built it. It's a great piece of Tulsa history, and we really want to shed some light on it here at the museum. And what was one of its first missions? Sure. So it had quite a few but it mainly proacted in the bombing runs of the late 1944 uh, area. So a lot of areas like Italy, um, Eastern Europe, we saw a lot of action in there with the Tulsa American. All right, and along with this mock-up, so there's going to be some kind of virtual reality um, experience for visitors as well. Absolutely. You know, I tell people all the time, exhibits are about storytelling. And one of the ways that we can tell stories beyond just words on a poster board is through virtual reality. And it's a great way to experience one of those final missions of the Tulsa American. And you really feel like you're a part of history. And how does this virtual reality work? Is it like one of those goggles things or how is it? Absolutely. It's just a basic headset that you put on. It's connected to a computer. It's only about three and a half, four minutes. And it's age appropriate for everyone. So feel free to come check it out. Awesome. Sounds like fun. And really quickly, I want to mention, so Santa is going to be making a stop as well at the museum. So tell me about that fly-in. Absolutely. I'm glad you asked. Our Santa fly in on December 14th. Santa will be arriving by helicopter and you can bring anybody including older kids as well. We'll have plenty of activities for everyone and Santa will be there to take your requests and maybe hand out a few presents as well. That's awesome. So they have a chance to visit with him and maybe take a few pictures at the museum. Absolutely. All right. That's always a lot of fun. Well, thank you so much, Alex, for being with us this morning and celebrating National Aviation History Month. Thank you. All right. Well, the Tulsa Air and Space Museum and Planetarium, if you want to take a visit and check it out, it is open Monday through Saturday from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. and there is free parking there.